Yo, hi guys, Kevin here. Welcome back to Journeyman number three. So last episode, unfortunately, we got sacked by EIF in the Finland second division, I'm pretty sure it was. But we had an impossible job. We got took there to uh, for them to avoid relegation. We was already like eight points behind with six games left, I think it was. So it was an impossible job. The team wasn't good enough. Unfortunately, they sacked me after, I think it was like four games. We got one two draws no three draws one loss so it wasn't the best but we improved the team we actually got more points than i expected so i was happy with my little stint there but yeah i've been hol holidaying for a long while no one's been offering me any jobs i had a few interviews at a few teams uh, but we have finally got a job i think it came down to desperation at the end i just applied for pretty much anyone and we have been hired by CD Tapa Tio. They are in the Mexican League. A um, bit different to the, fin <laughs> the Finnish League. Um, so we're switching up a little bit. Only half a star reputation. They got a nice kit that kind of drew me in. <laughs> uh, they got a really big stadium, 49,000. They got excellent training facilities, great youth facilities, exceptional youth recruitment. Uh, I believe this team is like a feeder club for uh, one of the bigger teams in the main league, I'm pretty sure. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll probably... It'll probably say my affiliates. But yeah, I'm pretty sure that we're a feeder team to a, a bigger team. Like we're the B sort of team, as you, as you would say. Um, so it should take a little bit of pressure off. And we should get some nice players coming down from that main team. Uh, it should make us play quite well. Uh, but yeah, we've got a few promises to do. Uh, develop players using the club's youth system. Play attacking football. Cannot sign non-Mexican players. Develop players for the main club. So that's a big key that we're, we're like a B team. We need to use the top players, like teams that aren't good enough yet, but are going to be good enough. And we need to use them quite well. And give playing time to first team players. So we we are quite restrained. There's a lot that we have to stick to. Like these are required. So I need to not sign anyone who's non-Mexican. Develop players from the main club. Any any that we get on loan down, I've got to play. And give playing time to first team players. Uh, so yeah, looking quite forward to this. I've never, never had a job in South America. The same as like the Finland job. It's all strange to me, um, so hopefully we do a little bit better than we did in Finland. So in terms of a budget, we've, we're minus, which isn't too good, <laughs> unfortunately. And scouting budget, we have got a scouting budget of 54k. I don't know if we have any staff members. We haven't got a chief scout. We've got two out of one coaches somehow. We've got assistant manager. Okay. Uh, under 20s so there is an under 20s that we might be able to get players from which is quite interesting i think we are all we're related to a big team by the looks of it uh, club info they're in the expansion league and i'm pretty sure we must be affiliates Chivas. So we're probably a feeder club for Chivas. So if we was to go into like their under 20s, we could probably take a lot of these if we wanted to, but obviously they're un unavailable. Things like this. So we've got to try and settle into this job uh, in terms of what position they're in at the moment. Competitions. Uh, we're in the opening stage, so second. Somehow we're second, and the guy got sacked. That's good to see. So we probably got quite a nice team. Let's have a quick look at tactic. No, let's have a look at team report. So overview. So it looks like we've actually got quite a good eleven there. In terms of stars, I haven't looked in depth into them. Uh, we got Zamora. He hits Rosette. He's in. He's at left back. Uh, but in terms of style, it looks like we're doing quite well there. Uh, squad depth. 
defensive midfielder, there's not too many. So I may look at switching the formation, maybe. Uh, like, say, if we was to do 4 2 3 1, let's go with the same, same as the last. But even that, there's only three players who can play there. Most, all of them are midfielders. Maybe like a 4 2 4, like a 4 4 2, maybe. But like a 4 4 2 would be more suited here. Or like a 4 2 4 or 4 2 2. No, 4 2 2 wide. What? Where is it? 4 2 4 2 4 wide. There. I think this would be more suited to the players we've got here. So yeah, I might look at doing this formation. It's the same as this is the same formation I was using on my Maidenhead save. And it does play really well. I may look at doing similar tactics as that because we was winning like every league. So, yeah, that's the squad. It's looking quite good. There's a lot of depth in it. There's a lot of quality in it. So I can't complain here. I feel like I've fell onto a bit of a winner, if that makes sense. Okay, so I'm going to go 4 2 2 2. 4 2 4, uh, four, two, four wide. <laughs> I was going to say, that's four, two, 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 two. Uh, but yeah, I'm not going too intense. Uh, we're going to press, but obviously not, not too bad. Uh, keep a bit of energy about us. Uh, we're going with wing backs, going with wingers on support, going with two advanced forwards, and then we're going to go advanced playmaker and deep line playmaker. We kind of want to control the games. Um, the, the team wanted us to play sort of attacking football and like exciting football. So I thought nothing better really than playing with two playmakers in your midfield. Um, so I'm going to go with that. One thing looking at this team, we have very poor strikers. For some reason, they were not showing up a second ago. Why were they not showing up a second ago? Like even right, right back, we got a left back. What? We can play. Where are these players coming from? They're not there, look. Where are they coming from? So confused. Maybe we're taking them from like the under 20s or something. But no idea what's going on there. I, like, I set up this team and there was no options for these players. And then all of a sudden I can pretty much just, I've got players everywhere. Like, I didn't have a right back. Like he was the only right back and he's injured. And now, for some reason, I can play a right back. Oh, no idea what's going on there. And so centre mid, we're okay. Wingers. We, this guy looks better, the Torres guy, but obviously he's injured. So we're just going to go with Mangana. He's got some nice, nice sort of average stats, if that makes sense. Uh, we've got Michelle Benitez. He kind of looks the best player in this team. His physicals are just really good. Dribbling's really good. And he's just got nice mentals. Like he could be a really good player if he gets his mind right. Then these are two strikers that I didn't know were here. <laughs> We've got Luis uh, Puente, who's just got the key stats that you need, really. He's got physicals and he's got finishing and he's got dribbling in the first touch. He's going to be really good. And then we've got Sebastian Martinez. I'm wondering if these have come down from Chivas, like they gave them to us or something. Because they were not showing up for some reason. Uh, but yeah, this guy's good as well. He's got good physicals. This team's looking really nice. Uh, the fact that they're second in the division already kind of shows that they are pretty much a good team. Okay, so it looks like we've joined this team at a very strange sort of time. We've joined in the quarterfinals. I'm assuming this is just the quarterfinals of the league or something like that. Like maybe like the top six go into the quarterfinal. I don't know. I don't know what is going on here. But the next game is saying it's a quarterfinal. So I'm sure we're going to find out who the opponent is at some point here. Uh, I, was, I was just looking because there's no games coming up. Uh, this training is already arranged and I can't seem to change it for some reason. But there's no games. I was like, where? What? what is going on? So... It looks like this is over. The league is over. Like 15 games played. Seems like you just play everyone once. 
and then it goes into these quarterfinals, which I just I'm a bit confused to be honest with you. Very confused. So I guess I just wait and see see who it um who it gives me to play. I guess with the previous save, I'm just going through all the free agents, just getting them into the club, seeing who I can get maybe on a free because uh, there's no money at all. And the team's looking pretty good already. I'm just trying to build up a short list. So we are prepared in the summer if, or a winter. I don't know when this league would end. Uh, but we're ready for when that happens. And we just got a short list built up. And we can pull, hopefully pick up some, some of these free agents that are still here. Unfortunately, as we don't even have a scout at the moment... <laughs> Uh, it's not going too well. Okay, so in here. Because uh, our squad is actually quite good. Uh, it's not really, actually. If you look at the ability, compared to these trial list, they're like, what is it, two stars the maximum ability? So pretty much all of these trial lists are, well, up to this point, are better or above. So if we just do these ones, add them to the shortlist indefinitely. And then these ones down here. See, they've got good potential though. I think I'm going to do it by potential. If their potential could be five star, I'm just going to chuck them onto the shortlist. Okay, here we are. Some news about what is going on. So we've got a quarter fine draw today. And there's a few teams in here. And so we are going to play a U. Universidad de Guadalajara. I literally just murdered that name, I think. But they're, it says they're 12th in the expansion league. Doesn't that mean they're league above? No. So yeah, we came second, they came 12th. So it's the same league. I thought them, we might have been in league two, so they would have been a better team. But yeah, that's a good draw. If we're playing 12th in the league, can't complain at all. Games are coming thick and fast. Familiarity with the formation is not too good at the moment, so I'm just going to do a bit more uh, match preparation. Just do like a bit of tactics and try and get teamwork as well. Yeah, this seems pretty like a pretty well set out sort of team, if that makes sense. Because we got. Like staff seems to be okay. We've got two coaches for some reason, but we got no scouts, but we got physios. I because I've never managed a team that feeds another team. I'm a bit confused how this is all working and like I've got another another um button here to go to Shivas. But this this mean that I can pretty much just take anyone from here? Or does this mean that I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how this works. I don't know if they just give me players and I just have to use them or... I don't know. It's a dynamic that I'm going to have to try and learn. But in terms of this, like I can't pick any different players. This is the squad that we have. Um, so yeah, that's what we're going to stick with. Yeah, so it seems like they've properly dwindled down staff members here. Like They've put a new limit like most of them are zero now. For some reason, it's really cut back. Like you could have eight scouts before and now it's one. Like what is going on? I'm a bit confused with all this first team, second team malarkey. You can see why now. Uh, there's a few players that those ones that I want to pick, they're unregistered. Like cannot be registered for next match. Under 23, a player. Hmm. Don't know why I could select them on the like tactic screen, but then coming into here, we've got no right back. We're going to have to play a left back on the right hand side. Um, we've got two strikers who look quite poor. Like, I know that's bad to say, but he's got nice physicals, but his finishing is one. Like we're literally playing with a guy who has one finishing. I mean, there's no one I can put in there instead. Uh, we've got Irving Marquez, who is a winger. He like, he can't really play up front. But he's got higher finishing than our actual striker. So, I don't know what's going on here. Like, it's, it's just messed up. 
But let's submit the team. Like everywhere else in the team, we're looking pretty pretty good. <laughs> Uh, but for some reason, we've got unregistered players and I don't know what's going on here. All right, coming into the first game, it's quite a nice stadium, this. It's very big. Um, and we're coming up against... Oh, I don't even want to try and say their name again. I'm just going to say what's in the top left. Udeg. We're coming up against Udeg. Uh, it's a highlight. Morelos is down the left-hand side. Uh, good tackle by Gonzalez. But once again, he's not a right-back. And uh, luckily, the other team actually missed there. Luckily. The nuts started too well here. Second highlight, for some reason, was just the guy getting yellow card. It's not a good sign because that probably means he's going to get sent off at some point. Uh, but we'll encourage the team. Oh, wrong time to encourage, wasn't it? Yeah, whatever we're doing here, we're not doing very well. Keep us onto that, though. What is this highlight going to come to? Uh, it's a long kick forwards. Benitez, he's latched onto that. And he's had a shot and it's tipped over by the keeper. So it's good to see. We're like, it's a hoof, but at least we got in on goal, had a chance. Flores with the corner, he's crossed it in. Uh, unfortunately, they clear that away. Okay, long throw coming in. It's a short throw instead. Playing good football here. It's out to Zamora. He crosses that in. Unfortunately, it gets headed away. But we're, it seems like we've got all the pressure right now. Building on the, on the edge of their box. Nice little hoof into Ramirez and it just sort of rolls, rolls off for a corner, really. Well, that was going to be a bit, little bit more. Oh, it's, it's a corner. And he pings it in. It's headed away. But the highlight is carrying on. So this could be a chance for them. Very poor defending there. Everyone just sort of ran away from it. But at least we stopped them from attacking, I suppose. Uh, so yeah, that highlight literally came to nothing. Um, the other team got a, a throw now. We headed that away. Whatever we do, do not get a red card. There's a lot of yellow cards on this team right now. Vermeerius is forwards. Played a good ball to Marquez. Marquez slots it, slots it into that bottom left corner. Is that the guy with one finishing? Because if, <laughs> if that's him, that is such a good finish. What a goal. Good play from Ramirez though. He sets that up nice for him. Lovely little through ball. It's hard for Marquez to like miss really, but he slotted it nice into that bottom left corner. Oh no, is it going to be offside? Surely not. Yeah, the goal. Right, into the second half. There's a highlight literally straight away, 46th minute. So we've got Marquez on the ball again. He's buzzing after his goal, and he's literally just had a wild shot. Literally a wild one. We've got another throw coming in. It's a long throw, and it's gone straight to their keeper, unfortunately. Keeper absolutely lumps it forward, but we latch onto that. Playing some nice football. Oh, Ramirez is in. He, he, he must be the one with one finishing. That was the worst shot I've possibly ever seen. Oh, it's a cross. It's hit the bar and it's gone in. Oh, no way. Literally one set piece. And they're back in it. 1-1. One, one. I don't know if away goals are a thing in this quarterfinal. But hopefully. <laughs> oh, keeper's had a bit of a stinker there. He went to grab it, but... Ball bounce off the bar instead. Okay, another highlight. It's the other team with the ball. That's going to be a red card. I did wonder. There was a lot of yellow cards on our team there. And it's the right back as well. Who can we even... We've got a left back on the bench. So I assume he's going to be the one. 
Marquez is the one. Oh no, Mark Ramirez is the one with. Ramirez is a centre back, and we're playing him up front. Surely not. I don't know what is going on with this team right now. I'm so confused. Like he can play up front, but he's got one finishing. What what is going on with this team? Okay, let's let's take off Ramirez. Oh, Ramirez could go straight into right back, couldn't he? <laughs> he can play right back as well. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, Ramirez, you just go back there. <laughs> back to where you belong. I don't know what's going on here. If if we get a result out of this. The other team got a corner coming in, cleared off the line. There was no defenders then. Oh, got a throw, come on. Get a chance from this. Benitez. Zamora's headed that down to Macias. Into Zamora again, he's crossed it. Come on, let's get a chance somehow. Ramirez. Agu Aguero. Ah, oh, no. Gave the ball away, it's going to be their highlight. Yeah, they're through the middle. And uh, it's luckily they've missed the whole bloody target. So they got a dangerous free kick on the edge here. This is looking very dangerous. And it's gone straight in. The keeper has done awful there. Awful. That literally was straight at him. It was literally down the middle, look. Oh my god. No way. So yeah, we're 2-1, so I don't want this to go any worse. So I'm going to drop it down to a defensive. Do I, though? Might even go very defensive. We don't want to lose any more goals. Seeing as this is a two-legged sort of thing, we want to try and hold on to what we've got here. I'm going to do a few subs as well. Who can we bring on? Right mid. We put Marquez there and then bring on Mangana up front. Got a good pace, seven finishing. I should have played him up front instead of centre back. What is going on with this team? Uh, two midfielders are going to keep on because they look pretty good. This guy's quite good at tackling. All right, let's leave it for now. Confirm the changes that we just did. All right, we've got a throw, a highlight. Oh, what a waste. Oh, win this. No, oh, we gave the ball away. Please don't score. Good defending, lads. Good defending. This is possibly the worst start to a manager. A manager coming into a team. Like, I mean, the quarterfinals with a team that's literally messed up like i've got no right backs i've got no strikers i've got a center back who can play up front i've got left wings that can't play up front i don't know what's going on i just need to see this game out 2-1 hopefully no that's bad go on save it yes go on well they're, they're gonna have so many chances i can feel it we just need to survive at 2-1 come on oh, oh score it's a cross Oh my god, he's missed. Aguaro. Aguagio. How the hell do you say that? Aguayo. Aguayo. He misses from literally about one yard. That is not what you want to see. Oh no, they got another chance. Good save from Jimenez there. Even though that was probably going wide, he could have left that. Waste, wasted a bit more time, you know. <laughs> I'm kind of just hoping for like a set piece and we can kind of just score somehow. Okay, so we made it full time. A lot of yellow cards. Like the other team didn't even have a yellow card, but look at this. And we had a red card. What on earth? Why is it so... One-sided in the instead of oh god, why is it so one-sided in terms of yellow cards? Oh, of course I get hiccups now, don't I? 
Damn it. Right, so into the second leg now. Uh, we're at home, so I'm hoping we can do something here. But I've got to do something about this team. Obviously, we've got a suspension. We've got the keeper is somehow now unavailable. Uh, so I'm going to do a quick pick here because I don't know what is going on with this team. Like we've got Cortez, who's injured. Like he's still injured. Why on earth are we playing someone who's injured? I have literally have no idea what's going on with this team right now. And it is blowing my mind. But I think I'm going to play... We haven't even got... Do we play Zamora? I think we actually have to play an injured player. I think that's, it's actually got to that point. No, let's play Ramirez. He's the right back, isn't he? Technically. And then... Angana. He's got seven finishing. I could play him up front. <laughs> oh, we got two Manganas. We've got Kevin Mangana as well. He looks slightly better. I'm going to play him up front with Marquez. As Marquez... God, what is this, man? This is probably the weirdest team I've ever seen in my life. What on earth is going on? Okay, so this is the team we're going to go with. We've got Sergio Flores and Masias in midfield. Hopefully these guys just run the game. Hopefully, because they're the two that we're going to rely on. Um, so let's jump into this. 2-1 down from the first leg. We're going to keep going with this tiki-taka 4-2-4. Uh, let's see where it takes us. Okay, so we're in our home kit. Red and white stripes. First highlight here. I think it's fallen to the other team by the looks of it. They're pinging the ball about with some with some tempo right here. We head that away. But they're straight back onto the ball. Garcia's at the back post. He squares it to Sanchez and it's tapped in. Damn, man. This is not good. I generally think it's the lineup though. Like I've got no strikers. I've got no right back. Other than that, the team is actually okay. But we have no strikers. I'm playing a winger. And even the centre-back was a better choice. And he's got one finishing. This is probably the weirdest setup I've ever joined. Ever. I'm so confused. So another highlight to the other team, unfortunately. Oh, it's a loss. That's such a good goal. What are we saying? That's about 25 yards. Straight into the bottom corner. Not much we can do here, really. I'm just kind of sat here just watching it happen. I can't. I can only put another centre back on up front. <laughs> I feel like I've been kind of given a short straw here. So a highlight straight from kickoff. Seems like it's the other team's highlight again. I think we're going to go down to about 5 6 nil here, I'd have thought. He's just running straight through, lads. Oh, a bit of fight. Let's do an encourage. Another highlight. It looks like their highlight again. They've got the ball. I don't think... Have we even had the ball? That's probably a good question. We've got it. Do not hoof it, whatever you do. Oh, he's hoofed it. Oh, that's just beautiful, isn't it? It's beautiful football, lads. Considering we're meant to be playing Tick Attacker, that is not ideal. My light is carrying on, so there's going to be something coming of this. And it looks like it's going to be the other team. Oh, we've won it back. Flores. You're in the midfielder. You've got to do something here. Macias. He's doing a nice run forwards into Torres. Plays it back to the right back. Cuts it back to Torres. Cross to Benitez. And he finishes it. Come on, a little bit of hope. A little bit of hope. So we're going to go attacking now. Build on that little moment. That was, some, that was actually the first bit of football we've seen. And we score from it. A nice little finish there from Benitez. I don't know where he's playing. Left Attacking left midfield. Could play up front if he wanted. We got no one up there. Uh, 
Uh, highlight from the other team. It's a corner. We've headed it away. But they're straight back onto it again. Second balls are just non-existent at the moment. Oh, win the header. Oh, where's the right? Oh, we ain't got a right back, have we? So, yeah, that's another goal. A right back who's filling in, who's meant to be centre back, but was playing up front. Just let the guy run in. Damn it. So, yeah, we got some work to do on this team. Like, there is some really good players. Like, the two midfielders, they look quite good. The wingers, they look fairly okay. Sent one centre back looks okay, but other than that, this team is a bit, a bit not good. Like the fact that we don't have a striker is just worrying. Like I just, what can you even do? I've literally got a half a star, half a silver star up front. The mess. So incoming corner from Flores. He's pinged it in. Going to be a red card. It's a red card. Two red cards in my first two games. That's good to see. Uh, I'm just going to leave it as it is. We need the we need the attacking this, but we're down to one midfielder now. What an awful game! Just wanted to end. All right, we got a throw. Santos. He's thrown it into Flores. Back into Flores, Santos, Flores, nice ball, Marquez, little tap in. All right, three two. Oops, there's no hope really, is there? We have got ten men. Oh, god damn it! All right, the other team attacking us once again. They're just queuing up on the edge of the box. Look at them, and it's a goal from Asensio there. I bet he's a striker because he's actually scoring goals. <laughs> oh god. This is not a good start to a journey, man, is it? I got sacked from a team that wanted me to survive relegation when they were pretty much already relegated. And now I've come to a team that don't even have a team. Uh, I'm just confused. How are they even second in the div in the division? Like, yeah, how are they second? That doesn't even make sense. I guess maybe they get like the players down from Shivas. And they played them throughout the season. And at this moment, they've got no one. Because that's the only reason I can see. Because there literally is not a striker. Uh, 88th minute, we're passing it around our back four. Just trying to see the end of the game. Uh, I haven't even done any subs. There's been, <laughs> there's been no point, really. Flores has played quite well. He's probably been our best guy. Other than that, oh, we're in. Mangana, he scored. Is there hope? Not really. We've still got to get another two goals. Let's, you never know. Let's just go very attacking and see what happens. <laughs> That's the only change I'm doing. So frustrating. Like, how can I join a team with this as the setup? All right, that's the end of the game here. Tapatio, unfortunately, we have been beaten in the quarterfinals. I can see why. Like we we're missing just key positions. Like I I don't know what I have joined here. Absolute mess. Um. So yeah, that is that squad screen. Like if I get rid of the the um. Uh, what do I know? What do I want to get rid of? I want to get rid of the high players. Loan or trial. So this is the squad. There is literally not a striker. How, how, look, what have I joined? Like under 20s, let's have a look. Even they've got a striker. What? Puente. So he was the one that I tried to put in, but he was illegible. So like I could move him to the squad. And then but he still wouldn't be eligible because he probably hasn't played that season. And you've got Martinez, like they've got better I'm 
that is done. That's done. Quarterfinals done. We haven't been sacked yet, which is good. Hopefully we can just go into next season and just try and try and build something, I guess. In terms of our schedule, I think that's pretty much it for this season, I'm assuming. Uh, but there's a very long break because it's only started in what did that start in August and it's November. Surely there's not gonna be a uh, just a gap to August, surely. I'd hope not. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to end this episode here. I'm going to skip forwards. I'm assuming like once the final has been played and things like that, that's in the background, we will be able to kind of move on to the next season. I don't know when that will start because this one started. Um, uh, if I look at the schedule, this only started in August and it's only November now I'm so confused what have I joined what what league is this <laughs> um, so that is very very confusing so I'm going to skip forward a little bit hopefully when these quarterfinals and things like this has ended like semi-finals and then we got final which is in 6th of December. So I'll skip to that point and then see what happens from there. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm sorry about the results, but I've got no strikers and I've got key positions. Uh, literally no one. So unfortunately, that's the way it was. Unfortunately, we joined a job that you can see why the guy got sacked because <laughs> there's pretty much not a squad here. But if there's a, if there's a transfer window coming up, Hopefully we can sort out this mess. So see you guys in the next one.